and welcome. My name is Brielle. I'm a part of the Power Moves Yoga team here in St. Charles, Illinois. Thank you so much for coming on your mat and enjoying your yoga practice with me today. We'll go through a short sequence here of a gentle vinyasa flow to kind of help open up, re-energize, and get re-centered for the rest of our day. We're gonna get started in rock pose. We're gonna bring our heels together at the touch of our base. Pull your hips forward just slightly and rest your palms right underneath your belly. Pull your shoulders back as you soften across your collarbones and lower your gaze. And take a few moments here as you settle into your space. A few deep cleansing breaths to allow anything to resurface here. Any thoughts, emotions, or feelings that you might be holding on to. And with each exhale, release and soften, allowing all of those things to tremble off to the edges of our mat. bones and as you exhale feel the sinking of your belly notice you sinking back a bit further and take a few more rounds of cleansing breath here closed. We'll create a ujjayi pranayama. We'll continue to deep breathe in through our nose, letting your breath trace down your spine and connecting at the bottom of your belly. And as you exhale, let this breath escalate back up and release this air out through both nostrils, finding a bit of a hum at the bottom of your breath. Take five more moments of stillness here, allowing your breath to recharge you. here with your breath and as you inhale reach your arms overhead and as you exhale take a lateral bend we'll guide your right hand down reaching your left hand over and across taking a full deep breath here through your side inhale to center as you exhale take a lateral bend and ground down your hand keep your gaze lifted and soft Inhale to center. And as you exhale, we'll take a twist. We'll send your right hand to the bottom of your base, your left hand to your knee. And as you twist, hug your hips back forward and then keep your gaze towards the corner of your back mat. Inhale to center. Exhale, twist. Take this one more round together. As you inhale, come to center. Reach your arms overhead. As you exhale, take a lateral bend, ground down. Reach for the opposite side. Inhale to center. Exhale, bend. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, twist. Make your connection. Guide your heart to the side. 
Inhale to center. As you exhale, one last complete twist. Inhale to center. And exhale, hands to heart. Take a moment to find a dedication with this practice for you here today. Allowing any thoughts to bubble over and accepting every emotion that rises. And take a communal breath in. And as you exhale, release and let go. Lean forward and we'll meet in a tabletop. We'll ground your hands, stack your hips over your knees, and find softness through the tops of your toes. We'll tuck your chin in towards your collarbones and hug the bottom of your belly up so that we find a straight alignment through the crown of our head, down through our tailbone. Take a few rounds of cat cow. Inhale for cow pose, following your breath. Hug your ribs forward as you peel your shoulder blades back. As you exhale, cat pose, hug your hands into the ground, relax your head and neck. Inhale for cow. Exhale for cat. And take two more rounds here, allowing your breath to guide you, finding a moment of pause between each movement. to re-neutralize and press back into our first down dog as you pike into the ball mounts of your feet keep your hips lifted high and send your shoulder blades towards the top of your thighs we'll take a little bit of movement here anything that feels good and organic opening up not only our hips our knees but our ankles as well a static down dog you feel free to keep a little bit of a bend here within your knees as long as you grip heavy in the L shape of your palms your index and your thumb to help keep your heart heavy inhale bend your knees exhale walk up to ragdoll pose we'll keep our feet behind our wrists grab onto opposite ends of your arms as you let your head your shoulders and your torso rest towards the ground can find a little bit of movement here. And release. We'll take your time, guide your toes back to center. And following your breath, inhale mountain pose. And find the sensation underneath your feet as you grip heavy. As you find your breath in, reach your hands overhead. Find softness across your heart heaviness as your hips hang towards the ground. Take a full round of breath. And as you exhale, we'll grab onto our hands behind our bum, interlacing our fingers. As you inhale, find a chest expansion. As you pull your hands down, let your chest rise towards the sky. Feel free to open through and across your neck. As you exhale, keep the spine forward fold, softness through your knees. Let your hands rise as your heart sinks. Hold here for three, two, one. Release your bind. Inhale, halfway lift. Guide your hands to your chins. Keep your gaze neutral as you hug your belly muscles up and in towards the bottom of your ribs. As you exhale, plank pose, ground into your mat. Lift your thighs, your shins, and your heels off your space. Inhale, hinge your heart over your palms. Exhale, lower all the way down to your belly, letting your heart arrive last. Set up for scorpion pose. Find length here through your left hand. We'll kick your right ankle over and across. Find a connection here with the ground, with your toes, as you soften your left temple to the mat. And slowly 
roll back to center. Take baby cobra. We'll send your thumbs to the bottom of your ribs. We'll keep your elbows in close towards your midline. As you inhale, find pressure through the tops of your toes. Baby cobra, lift within your palms. Keep your neck and your gaze neutral. And as you exhale, take scorpion. We'll tee out our right hand. Kick your left ankle over and across. Let your foot find connection with the ground and soften your head. Take your time to come to center. Find baby cobra one more time here. Maybe finding a little bit more of a lift. As you exhale, down dog. And lift and sink your hips back. And inhale, bend through your knees. As you exhale, walk your feet behind your wrists. Inhale, slowly rise, mountain pose. You exhale, bind your palms. Inhale, chest expansion. Let your heart reach for the sky. As you exhale, forward fold. Let go of this energy and this tension. And release your bind. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plank pose. Inhale, hinge forward. Exhale, lower all the way down into your belly. Set up for scorpion. Carry your right hand across or your right ankle and lift. Inhale to center. Baby cobra. Full inhale as you lift. Exhale, soften. Take scorpion here on the other side. Left ankle over and across. Inhale to center. Baby Cobra. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, bend through your knees. As you exhale, walk to your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, mountain pose, rise. Exhale, bind. Inhale, lift for a chest expansion. Exhale, forward fold. Release your bind. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plank. Inhale, hinge forward. Exhale, lower yourself all the way down. Send your left hand out. Inhale, scorpion pose. And gently come to center. Full breath in, baby cobra. Exhale, release. Take scorpion, send your right hand out. Left foot reaches across. Gently roll back to center. Inhale, baby cobra. Exhale, down dog. And take a full, complete breath here. And as you exhale, see if you can soften your heels, straighten your legs. Inhale, your left leg up high. As you exhale, crunch. Hug your knee towards the center. Oh, ground a little heavier into your mat. 
and kick it up. Inhale, extend. Exhale, center crunch. Drive your left knee high towards your heart. Kick it up one last time. Full breath in on your extension. Exhale, hug. Inhale, extend. As you exhale, drive your left foot through. We'll set up for runner's lunge. We'll send your left toes to the corner of your space. Relax onto your back leg. You can stay here on your palms, or you can come down to your forearms and add a little bit more of depth and twist to this posture. We'll take a few cleansing breaths here. center. We'll lift back into our right foot. Carry your left foot over. We'll take half splits. We're going to hinge our hips behind us. We'll tent out your fingers here to start so that you can hug your spine in and raise it high towards the sky. And for this round, send your right hand over your head, your left hand behind you, and bow your head down as you find length here through your extended leg. side, regain your balance, we'll find low lunge. We'll take side plank, set your left ankle over and across. We're going to open up to the side of our space. Now you can take full side plank where your hips, your thighs and your shins are lifted, or come down to your back knee to add extra support. You'll find heaviness here through your base hand. Carry your opposite hand overhead, so that your shoulders stack on top of one another. Take whichever option feels good. Full breath here. As you exhale, plank to down dog. Inhale your right leg up high. And as you exhale, center crunch, hug your right knee up and in. Grip into your space. Inhale, extend. Exhale, center crunch, lift. Inhale for extension, last one. Exhale, press. Last full inhale, kick your heel up even a little higher this time. As you exhale, runner's lunge. Carry your right foot through, resting down your left leg, guiding your right toes to the edge of your mat. Again, take notice of what this side of your hip connects with and make any adjustments as needed. behind us and bow your nose to your knee. And bring your hands back to your center. Slowly roll yourself to a low lunge. And we'll set up for a side plank on our opposite side. Carry your right ankle across. Make any adjustments here. And exhale, plank to down dog. And inhale your right leg up high. Exhale, pigeon pose. 
We'll melt our shin into our space, aligning it right behind our palms. Soften your left leg, and then take a moment to kind of balance out your hip bones. Keep your chest lifted here, nice and tall and filled with confidence, or you can find softness as you guide your heart forward. Shirasana. Our hip that's on top, our left hip, we're gonna lift it up, roll it behind us. So we find Janu Shirasana towards the back of our mat. And take a few adjustments here, connecting the bottom of your right foot towards your inner thigh. Full breath in, fill up your lungs. And as you exhale, forward fold, reach over your extended leg. Find softness here. Try not to find tension in your low back. Maybe pull out just a little bit here if it's too much. Take your time, lift your heart. We'll find reverse gate. Send your right hand your hip. As you inhale, lift your hips up. Open your heart as you send your gaze towards the front. And exhale, release. We're going to make our way back to our floating pigeon. So we're going to roll our left hip up and over. Lift your bent knee. We'll find three-legged down dog. And down dog. Inhale, your left leg up high. Exhale, pigeon pose. Take notice of this side and any modifications that you need to adjust. And when you're ready, find softness within the stillness. Escape, send your left hand to your top hip. As you inhale, press your hips up, open through your heart. And exhale, back down. We'll find our floating pigeon. We're gonna roll our right hip up and over, 
Lift your left foot, and three-legged down dog. And down dog. And come down to your knees. We'll find Sukhasana, easy seat. We'll balance on both of our sit bones. Take a moment to wiggle out any tension. And then find a steady seat. We'll carry one hand across our heart, one hand on our belly. And take a full breath in through your nose. As you exhale, release. And take two more rounds, allowing your exhale to feel vocal. Inhale deeply through your nose. Exhale, release. And feel the tightness across your belly. One more time. Take a full breath in. Exhale, release. And connect back here with the natural rhythm of your breath. Keeping your gaze soft and neutral. Inhale, reach your hand over him. Exhale, hands to heart center. The love, light, and energy within me. It's the same love, light, and energy within each and every one of you. Together we bow. Namaste.